Hello everyone, welcome to Chemizon Complete Chemistry. So in our today's video, we are going to solve the third question of the same paper that is JAM 2022 paper. So let us first read the question. The major product formed in the following reaction is. So here what is the reactant that is given to us? The reactant is, which is the two functional groups, CHO means it is an aldehydic functional group. Okay, so the first step is you have to identify whether alpha hydrogen is present or not. Okay, because here which is the name reaction that is occurring that is called as intramolecular. It is called intramolecular Canizaro reaction. Okay, and what is the key identification of this Canizaro reaction? It takes place only in aldehydes or ketones where where alpha hydrogen is absent there is no alpha hydrogen what is the meaning of alpha hydrogen hydrogen attached to hydrogen attached to alpha carbon is called as alpha hydrogen okay now let us see this is a reactant molecule the carbon next to carbonyl group uh, let us see here the carbon next to carbonyl group that is this carbon is alpha then the second carbon next to carbonyl group is beta. The consecutive next is alpha, beta, gamma. Then it is delta and so on. So the first carbon which is exactly next to the carbonyl carbon is called as a alpha carbon. Okay, so let us check in this reactant whether alpha hydrogen is present or not. So this is the alpha carbon. Carbon can form maximum of how many bonds? Four bonds. You can see here it has already formed four bonds. So there is no alpha hydrogen. This is also carbonyl group. So this is also alpha carbon. Here also there is no alpha hydrogen as it has formed four bonds already. Okay, so now let us see what is the what is a Canizaro reaction. Okay, Canizaro reaction means which which reaction takes place in a Canizaro reaction? It is called as disproportionation reaction. It is called as disproportionation reaction. Now what is the meaning of this disproportionation reaction? When same compound or we can say same atom. Okay, here we are talking about same group. Okay, same compound or group undergoes oxidation as well as reduction. Okay, the same group undergoes oxidation and in the same reaction, the same group will also undergo reduction. Okay, now this can be of two types. One is called as intermolecular and other is called as intramolecular. Okay, when the Canizaro is between two molecule of same type. Okay, two different molecules but of same compound, then we call it as intermolecular. Okay, just like inter, -compe inter school competition, which means the competition between two schools. Similarly, intermolecular reaction means it is a reaction between two molecules of the same compound but both are different molecules. Okay, but there are two molecules involved. And intramolecular means there is only one molecule involved and within that molecule only reaction takes place that is called as intramolecular that is similar to intra school competition that is the competition between students of the same school. So here what will happen? Okay, before that we must know that alcohols, okay, alcohols when they are oxidized. Okay, this is very important. Alcohols, they oxidize to first form aldehyde. C double bond O H. Okay, to form aldehyde. Aldehydes are further oxidized to form carboxylic acid. Carboxylic acid. That is C double bond O O H. And if we go reverse, Carboxylic acid, if I do reduction, then I will get first aldehyde and then aldehyde will be further 
aldehyde will be further reduced if i reduce the aldehyde i will get what alcohol okay so now one here what will happen one aldehyde group will undergo oxidation okay and other aldehyde group will undergo reduction okay so let us say this first this aldehyde group undergoes oxidation so what it will form okay it will form carboxylic acid and this will undergo reduction so it will form this other aldehyde group will undergo reduction so it forms alcohol but now in the medium base is already present right so what will happen this aldehyde uh, this carboxylic acid will react with base and acid base reaction will take place and what we will get is we will get a salt okay sodium salt c double bond o o minus na plus okay this will abstract this proton this oh bond will break like this and this is the salt that is formed and ch2 oh okay so this is the final product okay so compare which is the final product correct final product you can see here this is acid and this is alcohol so this is the correct answer in option b what they have done both the groups are oxidized that is not correct in option c what they have done both of them are reduced to alcohol so that is also not correct in d they have done some intramolecular cyclization that will also not happen okay so the most important part in any organic reaction is you must be able to identify the reaction then things become easier after you know the reaction what is the reaction even if you don't know the name reaction you must know how it works what is the mechanism of the reaction okay so the here what is the correct answer correct answer is option a i hope you have understood the solution thank you